Hi, hello, welcome back to our YouTube channel. This is Balakrishna. Before you go to the videos, please subscribe our our YouTube channel and share to your friends. So today I am going to explaining class 10th chapter 7 coordinate geometry. So exam 16. Show that the points A 7 comma 3, B 6 comma 1, C 8 comma 2 and D 9 comma 4 taken in order the order or vertices of a parallelogram. So how we can prove that it is a parallelogram? Opposite sides are equal. Next, the diagonals are not equal. The diagonals are bisect to each other. Bisect means it is dividing to two equal parts. That means a point is dividing the line segment into two equal parts. So bisect to each other. So here AC and BD both are bisect to each other. So that means for the two diagonals, the common point is there. So that means the midpoint of two diagonals are same. Okay, then it is a parallelogram. So here. given a 7 comma 3 b 6 comma 1 c 8 comma 2 and d 9 comma 4 or vertices of a parallelogram okay how it is form a parallelogram so the diagonals the midpoint of the diagonals are same. So why? Because the diagonals are bisect to each other. That means the diagonal is dividing two equal parts. So here we know that diagonals are bisect to each other. That is midpoint of AC is equal to midpoint of BD. The two diagonals having the midpoint is same. So the common midpoint of two diagonals. Okay. So midpoint of AC. So you had what the formula midpoint x1 plus x2 by 2 y1 plus y2 by 2. So here the formula is x1 plus x2 by 2 y1 plus y2 by 2. Here also same x1 plus x2 by 2 y1 plus y2 by 2. So in AC x1 is 7 y1 is 3 x2 is 8 y2 is 2. So that is here 7 plus 8 by 2 next 3 plus 2 by 2. So that is 7 plus 8 15 by 2 next 5 by 2. So next if you get the same or not. So here the midpoint of AC and midpoint of BD is same then therefore the four vertices form a parallelogram. So here x1 6 y1 1 x2 is 9 y2 is 4. So that is here 6 plus 9 by 2 next 1 plus 4 by 2. So 6 plus 9 15 by 2 5 by 2. So the midpoint of AC and midpoint of BD are both are same. So therefore a, B, C, D or what it says form a parallelogram. So therefore, ends proof. So, so next example 17. If the points A 6 comma 1, B 8 comma 2, C 9 comma 4 and D P comma 3 are the vertices of a parallelogram taken in order find the value of P. So they given that it is a parallelogram. So when it is a parallelogram then the midpoint of the two diagonals are same. So here given A 6 comma 1, B 8 comma 2, C 9 comma 4, and D P comma 3 or vertices of a parallel ground of a parallel ground. So that is we know that 
we know that midpoint of AC diagonals are bisect to each other. That means the common midpoint of two diagonals. So here midpoint of AC, how much is there? The same midpoint for BD of BD. So how we can by using midpoint formula? What is the midpoint formula? X1 plus X2 by 2, Y1 plus Y2 by 2. So here X1 plus X2 by 2 next y1 plus y2 by 2 next here also x1 plus x2 by 2 next y1 plus y2 by 2 so here x1 is 6 x2 is 9 by 2 y1 is 1 y2 is 4 by 2 next bd x1 is 8 y x2 is p by 2 next y1 is 2 y3 is 3 by 2 so 6 plus 9 15 by 2 1 plus 4 5 by 2 next year 8 plus p by 2 2 plus 3 5 by 2 so any two order pairs are equal then their coordinates are equal so that is a first coordinates are equal 15 by 2 is equal here in this what is the first coordinate 8 plus p by 2 so 2 divide come to left side order pen multiple so that is here 15 by 2 into 2 is equal 8 plus p so 2 to cancel 15 is equal 18 plus p plus 8 come to left side pen minus so 15 minus 8 is equal p 15 minus 8 is how much 7 so the p value is how much 7 the p value is 7 thank you for watching my videos please subscribe my youtube channel and share to your friends thank you